morning, children of God. I hope you had a wonderful, restful night. I want to come here before you head out today, or even if you're already out and about. I want to come here and pray with you, and encourage you, and remind you of a scripture in the book of Matthew chapter 28, verse 18. The Bible says that Jesus came and spoke to them. He said unto them, All power in heaven and on earth has been given unto me. All powers. It does not matter what you are going through. It does not matter what mount how big how huge how you think insurmountable that mountain is all power is in his hands all power is in the hand of the creator of the universe all power power to change situation power to move mountains power for divine intervention power for divine turnaround Power that can transform lives. Power that can uproot you and lift you up from where you are. In that dark place. In the place of rejection and dejection. God has the power to lift you up. And put you in a place of peace. In the place of abundance. In the place of perfect health. In the place of sound mind. All power is in the, is in the hand of God. So whatever it is that you think right now is not looking as they're supposed to look. Or you're not feeling the way you think that you're supposed to feel. Or you have that, or you're going through a difficult situation right now with your health. Maybe it's that family member. Maybe it is even your, your, your family situation that you are going through dark times right now. I want to encourage you and let you know that all power is in the hands of God. Jesus has all the power in his hand to change your life, to change your situation. So as you head out today, it is not over. It is not over. God is just starting with you. It might look dark right now, but I'm telling you, your morning is coming. Because God has all power in his hand. It might look difficult right now, but it's going to become easy. Because Jesus has all powers in his hand. You might be facing eviction right now. It's not over. Because Jesus has all power in his hands. They might give you, they might, you might have been given a bad report. A bad diagnosis. And they say you have a few months to leave. Jesus has all powers in his hands. To change situation. He's not a God that sleeps or slumber is a very present help in time of trouble. And he has all power in his hand. So as you're heading out today, I want you to keep rejoicing that you serve a God that has all power in his hands. And if you've not yet known him, try him and see. And see that this God is a God of mercy and grace. God that has all power in his hands is able to save to deliver and to set free so i pray for you as you head out today that you will experience the power of god in your life you will experience the power of god in your health in your family you begin to experience a divine turnaround in the name of jesus in your finances you begin to experience the power of god move in the name of jesus in the life of your children you begin to see the power of god move in your mind you begin to see the power of god move and regulate your mind in the name of jesus the lord god will begin to move and do, do those things and perfect everything that concerns you in the name of jesus that the holy spirit will help you to surrender everything unto god today and you begin to see the grace and the mercy of god and see god moving on your behalf and moving in your situation I pray that goodness and mercy shall follow you today in the name of Jesus. And I thank God for you and I thank God for what God is doing in your life. Remember, God has all power in his hands. You have a wonderful and God-filled day today. Remember, today is the day that the Lord has made. So be glad and rejoice in it. Have a wonderful day. Amen.